रोज एक कहानी मॉरल स्टोरीज फॉर किड्स इन इंग्लिश शर्मान द हम्बल्ड पोएट There once lived a great poet called Sharman. He was very learned and knowledgeable in all scriptures and had command over poetry. Sharman was praised by the king, by fellow scholars, by his mother and also by his wife. However, his own father never ever praised him. Once there was a ceremony in the kingdom where Sharman was honored as the best poet. Even after the ceremony Sharman's father chose to ignore praising him Sharman was very disappointed He often told his mother to ask his father why he never praises him but the mother was too scared to do this Finally Sharman was filled with hate for his father He took a big club climbed on the loft and waited for the father so that he could hit him Coincidentally on the very same day the mother asked the father why he never praised his son while everyone in the kingdom praised him the father replied that he feared that if he praised his son his son would not work hard to improve himself on hearing this sharman realized how foolish he had been to even think of hitting his father with a club his father only wanted him to do well He set aside the club, jumped down from the loft and fell at his father's feet and asked his father to punish him for what he had intended to do. He told his father that he had intended to hit him with a club. The father told Sharman that there was no punishment needed and that he had been forgiven unconditionally. But Sharman insisted. So his father asked him to go and stay with his in-laws for 6 months and then come back to their house sharman left home without knowing the significance of his father's word on the first day sharman was served very good food at the in-laws house and was treated very well but with every passing day he was treated with more and more contempt towards the end of 6 months the shaman was not respected for his poetry or erudition at all but was treated as a servant in his in-laws house he was responsible for cooking cleaning washing the dishes and for the farm related work he was treated like a cheap farm hand he was underfed and overworked he missed his king and kingdom scriptures and his poetry his mother and most of all him missed his father and his home all of a sudden he knew what it was to be in his father's home where silence meant nothing less than great praise moral of the story is don't worry about getting praised do your work with complete dedication and honesty These stories are presented by Ethnic Science Foundation with collaboration of Libra Welfare Society.